up y'all and welcome back to another one. Oh yeah, we're at the lodge in Arkansas and it is 61 degrees right now. It is 3.45 in the morning and it's 61 degrees and it's extremely humid. Hey Freddy, what are you doing man? This is Freddy's first time to Arkansas as well as mine too. But we're here with Dirty Bird Outfitters. It's myself, Preston, and Brad. Snow Goose Conservation time, baby. I've been warning y'all we're coming down here. I've been wanting to come down here for years, but we finally made it. We're gonna be setting a massive spread today. Uh, I think there's gonna be two, 11 or 12 of us total. Uh, but let's go check in with the boys real quick. We're here. We're here. And it feels like spring. It does. It's crazy, 61, I'm gonna be hunting in a t-shirt today. Yeah, it's it's a weird deal. We're supposed to be getting rained on, on and off today. Hopefully it holds out until this afternoon once we got the spread picked up. But first off, I wanna give a huge shout out to Dirty Bird Outfitters for having all three of us down. If you guys wanna book an Arkansas snow goose conservation hunt, I will link Dirty Bird down in the description below. Go down there, give Matt a call, a uh, text, an email and book a trip with them. They're great guys and you'll have a great time. Oh yeah, here we go, boys. Hello. Oh yeah, this is nice. I'm, I'm glad you uh, came up with the great idea of bringing the Argo. Yeah, it's awesome. Oh, we're here. We are here. Oh, look at the machine the boys got. What a beaut. Oh, here we are. Got old Freddy here. Got the collar on him. We got the e-collar screaming. What are you thinking? Ready to rock and roll. Look at that new white gear, though. Oh. Right here, new thermals, baby. Oh, no, I don't got the thermal on. This is the no plugs, no limits. Oh, yeah, no plugs, no limits. Got that new white hat, though. Looks Everyone good. Get yes, sir. Get well, we're ready to go. We're sat down, laid down the first flock. Uh, the first pair actually just showed up. Uh, there's a flock about 50 on our right side. Uh, e collars blaring. Got the old tubes on. Oh, yeah. This is awesome. I've waited for this. It's warm. It's well over 60 degrees. And uh, yeah. But, anyways, we got 1,500 uh, dive bomb socks out. Socks and silhouettes. It's gonna be fun. A lot of work this morning, but yeah, lots of work. It's gonna be good. One thing though, look at these socks looking good. Got the clones out front. That's our kill hole. Spread's looking juicy. Yeah, it's it's big. We sat a blob today but awesome wind uh supposed to be drizzling on us a little bit the wind is increasing all morning which is perfect it's already really nice we're sitting at like 15 to 18 mile an hour gusts hopefully it'll get over 20 mile an hour oh boys are getting low sit they're getting low boys on the left oh my goodness look at this don't move fred let's look yeah Look at this single snow doing it. Yeah, buddy. Yeah, buddy. First bird down. There's Fred. Look at that. First bird. Hey, Fred, here. Here, 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 good boy, look at that. First bird, Freddy, here, 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 set, set, lay down, right here, lay down, lay down, good boy. Here we go. First bird down's a Rossi. Yeah, yeah, first blood of the day, boys. If you guys are liking the Arkansas conservation hunt so far, smash the thumbs up button. And again, I wanna give a huge, huge, huge thank you to uh, Dirty Bird for letting us come. Uh, this is a dream come true to come and to Arkansas for conservation. Uh, always been a dream of mine to do this. You boys have never chased the snow, let's get down here and try it. Yeah. It's gonna be a blast. Yeah. There's no better outfitter to be with down here in Arkansas than Dirty Bird, I'm telling you right now. They, they do everything in their power to get you on birds, I'm telling you. 
This was a 30k feed last night. So 30,000 snows were here. Lay down, Fred. Me and Brad are just sitting here talking. And we're like, I, I looked at him. I go, dude, I don't care what we shoot. This is awesome. Pretty lucky to be here doing this, huh? Yeah. Grateful. Very grateful. Very, very grateful. The amount of work that goes into uh, to providing hunts like this it's insane i mean snow goose hunting guys if you've never snow goose hunted or chased them hard or had to sit spreads at night or lay in the rain snow goose hunting is no joke if you want a uh, true challenge and you've never done it go try it Good Fred here. Let's go. That's Fred's first blue goose. Look at that. Good boy. Dead bird, dead bird, dead bird. There we go. Blue goose. Look at him. He's got a rusty face on him. Look at that, dude. Woo! Yeah, buddy. I didn't realize you were talking right there. Yeah. Here. Come on, buddy. Come on, my bird, my bird. Dead bird, dead bird, dead bird. Look at this, boys. <laughs> If you haven't smashed the thumbs up button, come on, let's get this video. Help us get it over 4,000 likes. Come on, y'all. Good, Fred. Look, hit that thumbs up for Fred. Good boy. That's a good bird. Oh, look at that. That's a pretty, pretty juvie. Dead bird, dead bird. Look at this. That's a gray bird there. Wow. Look at this. a good flock. Oh buddy, here, come on, let's go. Here, 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 dead bird, dead bird. Boy, how did them birds, that was a good flock. Here comes the rain. Hopefully this weather, this is the first rain, the first weather, the first wind that they've had down here in a while. So hopefully it makes these birds do real stupid stuff. Wow, yep, definitely specs, look at that. That's one thing about it, you gotta be choosy.
Dump them, boys. Just dump them. Who cares? That's why we're here. Dump them. Oof, that's a flock of birds there. Sit for it. Lay down. Look at this, boys. This is awesome. Fred just brought back a twofer, two snows in his mouth. Had both necks in his mouth. That's the first time he's ever brought back two birds at one time. That was awesome. I, I didn't even have the GoPro on for it. Pull him in here, dummy. Here we go, get ready. Good boy. Come on, buddy. Here, here, here. My bird, dead bird. Lots of juvies, I'll tell you what. <coughs> oh yeah, I wanna give a huge, massive shout out to Federal Premium Ammunition. Thank you so much. That's what we're working with. That's what we're working with today. We got a case sitting beside us. I just went through my first box. Tough. Lay down. Look at this single doing it. Oh, sit, 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 Fred. Nope, lay down. Lay down. Lay down. <laughs> sit. <laughs> Just letting her eat. Good, Fred. Here, let's go, buddy. Oh, Freddie, he's doing a darn good job today. Good boy. Here, here, buddy. Come on, lay down, lay down, lay down. Another Rossi, Ross bird. Lay down. single was right here. Wow. It was close. Good, Fred. Let's go. This is fun. It's nice not having to blow my call constantly and, and blowing that call, I'm telling you, it takes so much, you know, so much more work. Good, Fred. Here. Come on. Here, Fred. Here, buddy. Come on. Good boy. Lay down. Nope. Lay down. Lay down. Another Rossi. Lay down. Lay down. On the left. There we go. Letting her eat today, boys. Good boy here. Look at this gray bird that Fred's bringing back. That's a juvie. Look how gray he is. Here, Brad. Here, Fred. Here. Come on, buddy. Here. Lay down. Look at that ugly dude. Ugly juvie. Lay down. Look at that. 
Just an ugly juvie. Look what he's been eating there. I'll be darned. Lay down. Lay down, Fred. Good boy. Good boy. Nice! Woo! There we go, boys. Nice, boys. Good here. Let's go. Good boy here. Let's go. Right here. Good boy. Look at that juvie. Wow, look at that juvie. Yikes, he is ugly. I doubled on that. I went blip, blip. I was just waiting for him to call the shot. I was just waiting for him to call the shot. That was awesome. That was awesome. Uh, I hope you guys are really liking these videos. Uh, this is fun. Arkansas at its best. It's a good year. A lot better than last year, that's for sure. Here, Fred, let's go, buddy. Let's go. A lot better, lot better year than last year. Come on, buddy. Here, here, here. My bird. Well, here we go. We got you on the big camera. I want to show you the spread. Here's our kill hole right here. This is where we're shooting. And we just shot that three pack right here. They gave it up. Well, I'm getting her all loaded up here. We are done. Check out this uh, sweet little rig here. Big old skid bag loaded down. There's like 50, 60 dozen in that bad boy. Pulling it with this unit though. What an absolute unit this bad boy is. Ha ha ha. Daddy like, daddy want. Yeah, look what Cade has here. You shot a whole case. How many uh, shells do you think's in there, bud? Like three cases at least. Oh yeah. You know, three cases of shells, 40 birds. <laughs> <laughs> here we go, 40 birds today. Lots of grays. Check out this guy. Just an ugly sucker, dude. Look at this one. That one's even worse. Got some yellow faces on him though. The yellow on the face iron from the rice fields not from the ra maybe from the rice fields i don't know that's all that's what i always heard i wondered how true it is do I mean, you know said arkansas on the tundra and stuff up there where they get it but you think they oh you think they get it up in the tundra and carry it down with them probably or like just anywhere through their whole migration anywhere they go she's getting her workout in today yeah she is dude for that feed would you say that was a good shoot for what the feed was it had quite a few adults in it, but uh, I mean, for what we shot and what birds didn't skirt the edges, we did pretty well. I mean, pretty good. Oh, yeah, nice and sloppy. Well, we are back home from Arkansas, and we just got done with a little hunt. And check it out. Oh, yeah, we got snows. Yeah, back home shooting snows already. And I used the new chokes that I just got in the mail that y'all recommended me to get for the new Rite three and a half inch chambered. Oh yes, the new shotgun got a new choke. And I must say, I'm glad y'all recommended it because it absolutely did work. So what's gonna happen here y'all, the reason why there's reasons why I didn't close out the videos in Arkansas and we'll get to that in one second But like I just said be expecting the video of the new choke that y'all recommended down in the comments Remember it was a handful of videos ago for the old three and a half inch Rite shotgun. I like it But back to what I was saying about closing the Arkansas videos here So there will be one more Arkansas snow goose hunt coming y'all's way and the reason why I wanted to close them here is because the hunting was so hard that I had no time to really record everything I wanted. We worked, we worked, and we worked. The mud, the continuous rain. I mean, just stay tuned for the next video. We get dumped on, and I mean poured. Rain, torrential downpour, y'all. The second video is a good one, but I'm glad I came back home to close them because 
Like this first hunt, man, this is a good one. Uh, it didn't rain on us. That's what was beautiful about this hunt. And it was the first day laying on Arkansas soil. It was a 12 man hunt. This hunt, it was a really, really good traffic hunt. Small groups kept coming to the field. Unlike the second video, we had huge spins and huge mobs. So just stay tuned for the second Arkansas video, y'all. But I do want to give a massive shout out to Dirty Bird Outfitters for putting us up in a lodge, for putting us on hunts. I'm so glad that we pulled our own weight and just helped out by bringing the Argo. The Argo ended up being a huge help, especially in the second video. But if you guys wanna book a hunt with Dirty Bird, I will link Dirty Bird Outfitters down in the description below. Go down there, hit the link, get a hold of Matt, tell him you wanna come, tell him Bobby sent you. He will be very excited to hear from y'all, I'm telling you, he's a great guy. But before we go here, I do wanna show you all this. At duckswaterfowl.com, we are doing a mystery box, y'all. Same as last year, if you remember them from last year, you are guaranteed a $65 value for only 30 bucks. And yeah, I already ripped mine open, so here's mine. I couldn't wait to get it out of the package. First item is this Olive Thermal Ducks hoodie. Oh yeah. And the second item is the Next Generation Black Lab Tee. Look at that bad boy. Both of those items came in my mystery box from Ducks. 30 bucks. You're gonna get a $65 value in that box, I guarantee it. I will link the mystery boxes down in the description below. There's awesome products in them. You never know what you're gonna get. You might get a hoodie, a shirt, you might get a hat, a hoodie, you never know. But there is sizes small to 4X available, so there's something for everybody. But like I said, guys, be uh, sticking around for the second Arkansas video. Uh, it got muddy, and more muddy, and rainy, and more wet. But subscribe if you haven't. Hit that little notification bell down there because it will notify you when your boy uploads. I hope you guys are getting out there the hunting season. It's, it's winding down, y'all. There's not a lot of days left. If you have a chance to get out there and goose hunt, do it. Do it. Hurry. Get out there. The hunting season's almost done, y'all. But I hope you guys have a wonderful day. Until next time. Peace. I've been keeping it on the DL Got a girl that keeps it real